and it's Portugal to play in this match today against Barcelona. Portugal with uh, a wonderful football history, of course. We did win the Euros in 2016, we've talked about that. I remember 1966 when they pushed England all the way in England for the World Cup and actually finished third. Had a fantastic campaign led by Eusebio. Yeah, he was a huge name, wasn't he, in Portugal football? And if Ronaldo's a hero now, he was just as big a star back then. Now you've got your chance to check on the lineup for the home team. Rui Patricio starts in goal. Pepe starts with Jose Font in central defence. So a couple of strikers for them at the front end of the team. It's a real group mentality in this lineup about pressing the opposition into making mistakes and cashing in on it straight away. Well, it takes a lot of energy, a lot of motivation. It's easy to drop off, and when you do drop off that really aggressive closing down, that's when it can fall down. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Cristiano Ronaldo, strong and still going strong. Well, how do you keep this man down? Because uh, he can do most things with a football and fantastic in the air. Really strong, as you say, Martin. What a talent. I have to confess, uh, Alan, I just love watching Luis Suarez. I know he's had his problems, but for value for money on the pitch, his endeavour is quality. You can't take your eyes off him. He's world-class, pure and simple. The best players also are the hardest working ones. That certainly applies to this lad. PK. Sergio Busquets. And the attacking now coming from Barcelona. Well, there is cover if he loses. A definite foul. Very early on. That at any time in the match is a yellow card offence and he's not going to escape the booking simply because it's this early. No, he dived in. I don't think he or anybody else can have any complaints about that. Timely challenge, Adrian Silva, Ivan Rakitic, threading it through, he's in, he's got his shot off now, still a chance in there off the goalkeeper, it will be a corner. And in it goes. Cleared away, well away from goal. Pepe. Adrian Silva. The shot's on! Well, it looks a bad miss. I think the defender just put him off. Yeah, he's got to take a lot of credit for that because uh, he had to take the shot quickly, the lad who was trying to score. Adrian Silva. Good football between these two. Nice passing. There's good progress with this attack. Samuel Umtiti. De La Feu. Barcelona 
his corner. It's short the corner this time. And now he's looking for some support. It's Bernardo Silva. Could be dangerous. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Bernardo Silva. Here's Font. Pepe. Rafael Guerrero. Adrian Silva. Luis Suarez. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. There's the interception. Big game this for Barcelona. And they want to win. They know they'll have to give it their all to get that win. The goalkeeper who defies gravity, especially in slow motion. He's a big lad as well, he fills that goal. Corner's taken. It was a promising situation, they could have made more of that. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. Cavalier. He screened the ball well there. Got the tackle in. Caresma. Good vision. In behind is Ronaldo. Terrific tackle. Sergio Busquets. Pressed high here. Now Adrian Silva. Keeper's ball. No question about that. It's a weak cross, really. Ivan Rakitic. Iniesta. Great change of direction. Normally very good on the ball, not so good then. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Looks the goalkeeper in the eye. Tremendous working goal by Marc Andre Testegen. Oh, we all thought that was a goal, didn't we? Uh, the board shows three added minutes. Minimum of three minutes of time. Needs to. Clear his lines. Adrian Silva. On the move and able to cut out. So it's half time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Your view, Alan Smith, on Cristiano Ronaldo's first half. Room for improvement, I think you could say, from this lad. now for the second half to start. Sergio Roberto. Ivan Rakitic. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view. Cleared it well. Anticipated the direction of the pass. Lovely ball. De La Feu. Actually, they probably want the player sent off the offender, but he's only got a yellow card. I think he was a little bit relieved there, you know, looking at his face, but uh, he'll take that yellow. <laughs> Saved it, the goalkeeper. On behind for a Barcelona corner. Oh, he's going to pay the penalty for this, but the goalkeeper's done well. Well, he's one of the most agile around, and he, he used it there, didn't he? It's 
Messi's corner. Defended well. Iniesta. He's a brave referee here. He's pointed to the spot again. He saw it as a penalty. Well, those players aren't happy, and they wouldn't be, but uh, he's made a big call, and I think he's probably got it right. Penalty given, but no extra punishment for the culprit. Yeah, I think that's fair enough. I mean, it was a foul, but uh, he's not denied an obvious goal-scoring opportunity there. And the man coming off is Iniesta. He scored from the spot. Just touched in off the post. Goalkeeper absolutely beaten. No, it's a wonderful strike. Really crisp effort. A good look here again by the replay of the goal. Good news for Barcelona, they lead. Goal for FC Barcelona. Number 10, Lino Messi. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Makes a challenge here. He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. He's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy, actually. Now Guerrero to throw in for Barcelona. Substitution for FC Barcelona. And it is a substitute coming on for an already booked player. Coming on to the pitch, number seven, Adatura. Adatura. The break may be from Barcelona. Well, that pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Ronaldo. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Needs to stay cool now. Paulinho. Neatly intercepted. Could be dangerous. Tackle goes in. Cristiano Ronaldo. Going forward well. He's cut it back looking for a teammate. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Jordi Alba. Sergio Busquets. Little piece of interplay between the two. They could pose some danger now. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. In behind the defenders. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. That's cut out. Well, they're in a good position here. Samuel Titi. Can find some space here on the flanks. Jordi Alba. Fantastic game, this, and it's going to go right down to the wire. Luis Suarez. Attacking now. And here's the shot. They just can't beat the Barcelona keeper. Well, it is the goalkeeper's best friend, the clean sheet, and he's cherishing his. It's been such a good contest. Still just a one goal in it. Five minutes left now. Lionel Messi. Just lent the ball to his mate and got it back again. And now Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva. It's looking good, this move. Here's a chance! Confident goalkeeping here. Yeah, good hand to turn it aside. Substitution for... It's hard Anthony. to shut up shop, even with a substitution here, but that's what he's going to try to do, I think. OK. Coming into the pitch, number 14. Really vital interception here. 
the fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of got the ball minutes. and they're going at the opposition with speed he's very confident with the ball at his feet he's still going to Suarez and he scored and it's Suarez who's done it well take about Luis Suarez just a pleasure to watch him in this kind of form it's another late goal to emphasise the gulf between the two sides today. Yeah, and it's been that type of match. I think everybody out there, the strikers particularly, want to increase the goal tallies, and they've done it. Substitution for... It's going to be Portugal. a change for Portugal. Restarting at 2-0. Coming on to the pitch. That's the final whistle the from the referee. This is what happens in friendly games, of course. There are advantages other than the result. The players have got some action which they needed badly, but they would have liked to have not uh, got beat. You never like losing, and the fans have gone home disappointed, but uh, the manager will try and take as many positives out of it as he can.